Well, y'all, it is date night at the Walsh residence, and tonight is my night to decide what we're going to do. Every Saturday night, we go out to dinner or we do something fun, just the two of us, and every other weekend is my turn to decide what we do. So, like last weekend, Saturday was his day, and he wanted to watch the fight, the Mayweather McGregor fight. So, that's what we did. By the way, we love watching UFC, so it wasn't like I got gypped or anything on a date night. I enjoyed that night. But tonight, it is my turn, and I want to preface this video with, I'm not a weirdo, okay? So, what we're going to do tonight is he has no idea, but I prepared a Game of Thrones themed inspired dinner. Yes, you heard that right. He has been obsessed with Game of Thrones probably for the past few weeks. And that's because he watched the entire seven seasons in the last couple of weeks. We actually caught one of the new episodes of season seven a couple weeks ago on television, and he liked it. So we thought, huh, eh, we'll start watching it, see if we like it. And he became addicted. So he watched all seven seasons in like three weeks. I kid you not, yeah, I think it was three weeks. So he's into it, needless to say. I know the show is over. Season seven wrapped up last weekend. But he still talks about it, and the dinner reservations that I had initially made for tonight, earlier in the week, the restaurant called, and they had to cancel those reservations. They had to close for some reason. So I figured we would bring back the idea of the Game of Thrones-inspired dinner, and I've gone all out. Right now, at probably every single store, they've started putting out Halloween and fall and Christmas decorations. So I went and got a lot of Halloween decorations. I have skulls, crows, rats, chains... I mean, I have all kind of stuff. So I've decorated the dining room table in the formal dining room, and that's where we will sit. Also right now, I've got two racks of ribs in the oven because I feel like people back in the day ate a lot of ribs. Like, they didn't eat a lot of processed foods, you know? So a lot of meat and veggies. So I've got two racks of ribs going in the oven right now. I'm also going to roast some little red potatoes and carrots. And I do have a loaf of bread, and then I have some grapes, and I've got these like goblets for us to drink out of. But the best part, by far, is, I don't know if you can see it behind me, see that gold and blue back there? That's my dress. My sister went to a Renaissance fair, I don't even know how long ago, but she bought this costume to wear and I got lucky enough that she kept it, so I'm going to wear it tonight. And my husband's going to come home from work in, what time is it? It's 4.50, he gets off at 6, so he'll probably be home 6.30 in an hour and a half to an entire Game of Thrones themed dinner. And I'm even gonna find the music that they play in the intro and play that too as we have dinner. So what I figured I would do now, I need to go ahead and start getting ready. So we're gonna do a little get ready with me for this Game of Thrones dinner. And it's gonna be super simple because I am wearing that costume. So we're gonna do makeup that I think that they would have worn back in the day, which is very minimal. So it's gonna be very natural. And then my hair, I'll probably just straighten and maybe pull half up, half down. So that's the plan, so let's get started.
that is a wrap on the hair and the makeup. I put the dress on. I really like the hair. It's a little messy because my hair usually doesn't part down the middle. So I kind of like it. The dress is great. I just feel a little weird. I feel a little weird wearing this dress, but you know what? It's going to be fun. We're going to have a great time. He will be home in like 20 minutes. So I'm going to go and prep the rest of the food, make sure everything is good to go. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please give it a thumbs up and be sure to hit that subscribe button if you enjoyed it. Also, while you're here, hit that bell so that you're notified every time I post a video because they could be weird videos like this. You never know. <laughs> I will see you all in my next video. Bye.